welcome back my friends so get it for yourself and arduino nano or uno uh it's your choice okay it's up it's up to you so i'll be using this led green led so the uh, cathode of it i'm going to connect to ground through a uh, 100 ohm resistor and uh, the pin the anode to pin 13 so get for push buttons okay um, uh, in the in the program okay I did a, a uh, um, input pull up okay okay four push buttons no 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 I, I, I want to make uh, this build beautiful so uh, yeah at this position is beautiful because it's aligned you, can, you see so okay uh, great now um i'm going to connect uh, the uh, last push button to pin five pin five pin five pin five pin five pin five, pin five. here we go to the other pin pin five okay guys so if you follow this video if you f f follow it up you you don't need a uh, s secret diagram okay guys so don't be idle <laughs> uh, so we uh, we want to make things uh, things beautiful so I'm going to connect first of all the, the first edit uh the first push button to pin d1 pin pin i mean d2 pin 2 okay like that so pin d2 as we are doing countdown or timer pin d2 will be our start okay uh, the first push button the second will be the pause third restart and uh, the fourth push button stop okay now uh, this wire is attached to okay let's make things beautiful okay um, so we need to align okay uh, the wires so that uh, align very well so that uh, it can be beautiful the building so now i take the wire and uh, i attached to okay between okay so uh that's the uh, pin d3 d3 now these la uh, th i mean the third wire okay is going to be uh, i'm going to be attaching pin um to pin d d4 d4 to this push button Now D five to 
to the stop okay that's the uh, stop button so uh, i'm uh, i'm going to stop the countdown timer uh, using this push button okay make things beautiful okay like that okay okay beep 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 boop boom <laughs> oh no <laughs> Great. Great. I think we, we are done with uh, push buttons. Now, let's go to LCD I2 squared C. So, four pins. Okay, for pins with the uh, clock pin SCL, the, the data pin SDA, the VCC, and the, the Mr. Ground. Now, the yellow wire is the, uh, guess what? Is the clock pin. So, clock pin is going to be attached to pin to analog pin A5 the other to analog pin uh, I mean SDA to analog pin uh, A4 the VCC to 5 volts That little ble uh, black wire, I don't know the color, green, no, it, it's not green, I, I don't know in English. Uh, so, to ground. Great, we are done. Okay, now that's our program. So, you install the uh, liquid crystal library very easy guys you cut the library the, the name and you paste it here and you search for it uh, yeah the one okay the, the code will be available and here you you have the columns and the rows you need to also install the count timer count timer to count so you cap the name of the library and you paste it on the library manager on the search bar you paste and you and you and you and you're gonna see it okay that's our push button the first one is attached to pin D to start. Is to it starts the countdown. Okay, it it is going to count down to start. Yeah, countdown. And that's the Arduino Nano pin three. The second push button, the pause. And uh, the Arduino Nano pin 4 is the restart. Five. Five. Arduino Nano. I, I mean, four. That's four, okay? The third push button. And the last one is the Arduino Nano pin 5. Very simple, guys. So we need to create uh, this object, this counter timer object, T up and uh, T down and uh, T none. Okay, the uh, input pull, pull up these push buttons. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. 
Push button. Push button. Okay, now. Okay, the, these are for uh, to count up. Okay, and the other one is to count down. So here, I, I don't need uh, this line of codes. I'm going to remove them. They are useless for us at this point of time. Okay, uh, so we run the uh, the object um, created. So here we are using the digital read to read the push buttons. Digital read for start, for pause, for restart, for stop, for not. <laughs> okay. Um, I think we're good. Okay, I use a switch uh, case function to to read. Print time. None, uh, I mean, yeah, um, so guys, I, I know you are smart people and uh, you're gonna get that, okay? If you don't, so please comment. So now we, uh, we pick our board, the, the port, and yeah. Uh, done I go, now testing time we press start and it um, begins to count down from now to one and the LED turns on press again start okay and once again it starts to come down from five the LED turns uh, off you can press restart okay to start the uh, countdown timer that's pause. I paused and I start again. I start, okay? Yeah. Starts again. Pause. Start. Pause. Restart from nine. Start okay. If you press stop, it will re, um, stop all the timers and it will go to start. Okay, from nine. If you press stop. will start and uh, pause don't work or work so if you press stop so it, it, it will stop all the timers and uh, when you press start it will begins from the 